Hello, welcome back. Hello, as you can see, we have 194 of the uh, of the hardwood. Today, we are going to Ginger Island. For the first time ever. I've never been before. I heard it's lovely this time of year. Okay, I'm going to put these ancient fruit in the seed maker before we go. Okay, let's see how many seeds we get from these ancient fruits. We've got seven ancient fruits. So I'm hoping that we're going to get a decent amount of seeds back from that. And some apple in here. How many of these do we actually make? 11. Okay, we've got 11 more ancient fruits, which I'm pretty happy with. Uh, as soon as we get this filled out with ancient fruit and just we're pumping out ancient fruit wine, we are going to be cash rich. We're doing some achievement hunting and 100% uh, grinding today. This whole series is about getting 100% completion in the game, 100% perfection. Uh, we are working on a couple of achievements right now. We're working on getting the all of the heart heart uh, achievements, like five hearts with ten people, uh, ten hearts with eight people. I think is one. Um, also, the quests we've got to do quests for forty people. We've got to do forty quests, and then we're going to start working on stuff like craft every item, cook every every recipe ship every item. Things like this. Things that we'll need to focus uh, pretty hard on. Do we have 200 hardwood? We have 202. Right, we can finally finally finish off the boat. But while we wait for the rain uh, I decided to come and see my boy Krobus and I just realised I don't have... Oh dear. I don't have my sword with me. Um, hopefully we're going to be able to get through this without too much pain. Um... Just avoid those things turning into anything crazy. There are flies everywhere. I'm probably gonna get pretty messed up here. Ah, oh, they don't do much. They don't do much damage. This should be fine. There we go. There is the ink. I can probably fish for all kinds of good stuff down here. Um, I'll check this place out again another day. Right now, I just want to get the ink for the wizard. Then we can go and see his wife. The the little swamp witch, and I don't know if that's part of 100% completion or not, but we've just got to do everything and give it a good try. Okay, into the cave we go. Um, definitely nothing bad. And once again, a f hi goblin, um, or henchman. Your pass. Sorry, this is private property, chief. Uh, oh, so now do I need to go and speak to the wizard? Goblin problem. Get into the wizard. Uh, there's a goblin. <laughs> there's a goblin blocking the path to the witch's hut. There must be some way to get him to move. Maybe I should seek out more information on goblins. Do I need to? Is it like a? Does he need like a void egg mayonnaise or something like that? I'm pretty sure that's what it is. Okay, enough of that quest line for the wizard right now. Let's get a couple of good rainy days. Um. Oh. Oh no. Um, that wasn't the rain totem, I just made two beach totems. I'm a fucking idiot, I need tr oh no. Um, forget about Ginger Island for just now. I will work on whatever the comments say, like how to get to Ginger Island and move those turtles, how to get across the lava, I don't know, I'm gonna have to, I'll do some research later. What we need to focus on is we need an achievement. We haven't got a single achievement since we started this series. Uh, complete the museum collection, and uh, that's not going to happen today. A uh, ten heart friend level with ten with eight people. Not going to be able to manage that. Five hearts with ten people. That is something we can be working on. Uh, the recipes that's going to be a standalone video. Craft every item that's a standalone. Same with the fish. Help wanted. Right, we're going to go and check the help wanted sign every single day. We are going to get this. Go for anything else. 15 of each crop. I think that will come naturally. I could see which ones we still need so we can work towards that. Um, Prairie King's going to be its own video. Every star drop that's going to take a little while yet. We, we're working towards getting married. I think it's going to be a case where this series is us like leveling up everything and then they're just going to all come at once. Uh, but as for right now, we have some more uh, ancient fruit. So, I mean, I would love to turn all my ancient fruit into um, 
into Age Fruit Wine and get a lot of money from it. But I know you've got to work the long game in this. And the long game is just turn your Age of Fruits into seeds and replant them as soon as possible. And then when your greenhouse is filled with Ancient Fruit Seeds, then... Oh, and it turned into a... Man, mixed seeds, mixed seeds from the Ancient Fruit is painful. Uh, so we've got five new seeds we can plant. Yeah, it's a new day, so let's go and we're gonna make some make some more friends. Uh, Want to get the friendship level up with everyone? Um, we could maybe get the one that was I think it was what was it ten people at five heart levels? So five is here. So we've got one, two, we've we'll got three. Um, Robin at four, Pam at four, George as well, Marty, Caroline, Jody, and then they start to go down. So I think we just need to talk to everyone. Birthdays are a huge thing as well. Um, if I can work out when people's birthdays are by looking at the calendar, and uh, that would be hugely beneficial as well. And we have a new Help Wanted. I think we're just going to have to just jump straight into the Help Wanted and just grind these out. Fire Quartz, I've got one of those. To rub on my sore tooth? Alex, that's not the way to go around it. Um, whose birthday is it? It's actually Willie's birthday right now. What is Willie like? Okay, Willie, what do you like? What do you love? He loves catfish diamond. Um, diamond might be the easiest thing to give him. As we've got them in the uh, in the machine, just duplicating. So we need to get a diamond for Willie and a fire quartz for... Uh, what's his name? Alex. We got both. This is looking good. If we just do this every day, we're soon going to get... Soon going to get the achievements flowing in. Um... So, I just gave him the fucking diamond. I don't believe that. I gave him the fucking diamond. It's just like, thanks. Uh, oh, fuck's sake. Right, Willie's likes. Willie's likes. Gold bar quartz. All these fish. Uh, fish taco. Seafoam pudding, a trout soup. You know what? Just for ease. Just for ease. I'm just going to buy one. Uh, I'm just going to buy one and give it straight back to him. Okay, Willie. Uh, give me one trout soup. Uh, you'll never guess what I've got for your birthday. You'll never guess. There you go. He loves it. Um, although he actually doesn't love it. He just likes it. Okay, I know what I said, but it is raining. It is raining today. So I'm going to figure out part one of this little puzzle on Stardew's, on, on Ginger Island. Um, first, I think we've got to wait until nine for Willie to actually wake up. Still no way for it. I've been, and this, uh, also we're going for all the star drops, of course, as well. And one of the star drops you need is by giving the rare gem berry thing. Sweet gem berry. Uh, to the the master cannoli, and um, we can't do that until we grow that sweet gem berry, and it has taken a long time. Okay, let's check this out. Could you uh, bring me a ripe melon, George? Yep, I mean George. <laughs> I'm carrying what over forty of them right on me right now. Uh, Eight a.m. We can wait. We can wait, George. We can wait. Okay, we waited. Georgie boy. Here you go. Here you go, pal. Um, there we go. Right, is it this bird here? There it goes. It's shut out an aquamarine. I mean, birds do that sometimes. Uh, more wild bait and some taro tuber. Whatever the fuck that is. Um, okay. So we're going to slam this in. The, the south quadrant, I believe. Uh, I think this is right. Yeah, because like that's the dock. That's got to be the, uh, the volcano. No idea what that's. It's like a fried egg. And uh, that's palm tree. I guess that's right. Um, but you can only do one every uh, every rainy day. So you need to come back on four different rainy days. 
Um, is there still the big turtle thing? There is. How do we get rid of the turtle thing? Please tell me. Or maybe we talk to the parrot. Ten golden walnuts to get past? This is like an old school game. This is a proper old school game. Do this to do that. To do this, you've got to do this. Oh, wait, did I get up there? Yes! There we go. So we're up to three. Up to three of the golden walnuts. I, I can tell this is going to be a tricky one. Where there's going to be some really annoying... Uh, annoying parts of this. So the bird's obviously going to land here and he's going to say, Squawk, give me 25 golden walnuts to get across. And I'll be like, you dirty... Um, right, how do I get this one here? Oh, I must have to go across the bridge. To get across the bridge, I need to come down here. Um, or do I need to go up? Right, okay, so that's only... I get those after this. It's a little cave there. Um, nothing I can do up here. Yeah, I really don't understand. Um, and then it's one of these. It's just like going to be an elevator that takes me down to the other thing. That's what this is, isn't it? Gotta be. Oh well, back to the mainland. Unbelievably, we've had yet another rainy day. Two in a row. Back to back rainy... Why the fuck is it not raining here? Oh, I don't understand this. It's raining in Stardew Valley. It's not raining here. How the fuck do I know when to come? It's raining. Can you do it like once a week? I. What are the rules? Okay, we've got a whole bunch of ancient fruit. Uh, I'm just going to take all these seeds and just re restock them with six more. Um, how many seeds did we get? Twelve. We got twelve seeds from that, plus whatever we're going to get from there. Um, it's looking pretty good for the ancient fruit seeds. Yes, yeah, so I'm going to take all these kegs away, just because I would rather have them in the shed and have some other stuff in here. Okay, I still have some melon wine in here, or melon juice. Again, we don't know which one it is. And then in here, I want to decorate this place quite nicely. Um, but we're just going to have like a fucking wall of these. And then I'm just going to come along here with all my melons. And uh, just rattle them all in. And this place will be where we come to make our aged fruit wine every week. And any other wine and juice we get. Also going to put these uh, kegs. Sorry, not kegs. What are they called? Preserve jars. going to put the preserve jars in there as well. Uh, any wool from our rabbit buddies? Eight wool, okay. Uh, let, let's get some more cloth made. I don't really know how good a cellar cloth is. Uh, I have absolutely no idea. We'll find out today. Um, this is going to be the last day of this video because today is the Moonlight Jellies. So we're going to go there to celebrate and uh, shake some hands and all that kind of stuff. See what Mayor Lewis is getting himself into. And just because we need to buy every recipe for the uh, craft, one of everything, uh, I'm just deciding, I'm just going to buy all the recipes I can from all the NPCs right now. Um, anything else we want from Robin? Uh, we don't really have the wood for anything. Um, we could, could turn it into a big shed. Double the sizes of the shed, you know what? Uh, actually, we're going to move a couple of things, because I wasn't quite happy with these. These, uh rabbit hutches down here. I don't really know where I want them. That's the only annoying thing, it's like I don't really have any good places for them unless I like double stack them here. You know what? I'll just do that. I'll just double stack them. Um yeah there's enough room to get in and out. We'll put the uh put the better one at the front. Um that can stay there. I always forget to go and check out the uh the things I have in there. The mushrooms. Um, everything else looks okay. We can move this silo out of the way a little bit. And let's get this big shed. Fuck it. Go for it. Turn this into 
something that somehow has double the size now. Okay, it's time to end this video off right by going and seeing all our friends at the Moonlight Jellies. Um, basically, this whole episode has been getting to Ginger Island, trying to figure out what the fuck is happening at Ginger Island, and just raising the heart levels. I've been giving out a lot of presents, uh, something I can't do here. What can I buy here? Um, nothing. Nothing of any use apart from seafoam pudding. You know what? I'm just going to buy the seafoam pudding because when it comes to me having to catch all the fish, that is going to be a huge help. And finally, we talk to Willie. And let's go for it. Launch I thought Jazz was going to fucking launch the boat there. This is such a shame. This is an unskippable cutscene. Um, it lasts for like two minutes at least. And that's going to do it for this episode. Um, we did. Let's, let's just check out the heart levels here. Abigail's still on top. Evelyn is. Fucking watch out, George. Watch out. Uh, Emily, who I want to get married to. Um, Pam is now a five heart. Okay, that's four we've got in five hearts. George, you're right behind there. Um, George, Robin, Willie, we need to get on them more, and just everyone. Just, I think remembering birthdays is going to be such a big thing. Next video out will be in fall. Hopefully we'll figure out the conundrum about um, Ginger Island, and hopefully we'll get our first achievement of this series. Uh, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. Dunka, dunka.